there's almost no way to inspect the spray pattern of a fuel injector while it's on the vehicle. And it's impossible to inspect on a vehicle with direct fuel injection. However, you can witness the symptoms of a bad injector. For efficient combustion to take place, the droplets of fuel must be a specific size and properly distributed in the cylinder. The fuel injector nozzle, fuel pressure, and injector's location have a direct influence on the distribution of fuel in the cylinder. A malfunctioning fuel injector can also damage the catalytic converter. The oxygen sensor does not see unburned fuel. It measures the oxygen in the exhaust gases. So if fuel does not burn in the cylinder, the oxygen is not consumed. That means the engine will try to burn the oxygen by adding more fuel and raising the fuel trim. ECM can compensate by leaving the fuel injector open shorter or longer so more or less fuel makes its way into the cylinder. This approach can compensate for the bad fuel injector for a limited amount of time, and the driver might notice a drop in fuel economy. If you suspect a fuel injector problem, there's a few things to inspect. If the long-term fuel trims are above or below 11% and the engine is having to add or take away fuel, there might be an issue with multiple injectors trying to compensate for leaking, clogging, and or poor spray. Fuel injector codes can be classified into three categories. First, electrical trouble codes can indicate that there is a short, open, or the resistive value is off for the injector. Remember, most injectors share the same ground. Second, Misfire codes can indicate an issue with a specific cylinder or random cylinders. If a cylinder is too rich or too lean, the combustion event might not take place. Third, catalyst codes for efficiency will be set because excess fuel could prevent the catalyst from storing oxygen during certain conditions. Most fuel rails try to operate at a constant pressure and will change the fuel injector open times to control the amount of fuel being delivered into the cylinder. Lower fuel pressure will change the spray pattern of the injector. Also, if you see a condition where the engine is starved for fuel at higher loads and engine speeds, or running lean, the issue might be the fuel pump. Remember, when the engine is shut off, the injectors undergo heat soak. Fuel residue evaporates in the injector nozzles, leaving behind waxy olefins. Because the engine is off, there's no cooling airflow moving through the ports and no fuel flowing through the injectors to wash any of it away, so it bakes those waxy olefins into hard varnish deposits. Direct injected engines have it even worse because the injector is buried in the block or the head. Over time, those deposits can build up and clog the injectors. Often, the only way to restore the spray pattern for the injectors is replacement. New B-Pro Auto injectors will restore the factory spray pattern and bring the long-term fuel trims into the correct range. Your customers will notice a smoother running engine and increased fuel economy.